I'm going to teach you how to communicate so that people actually listen to you and respect you. I'm a psychologist, but I work with leaders around the world. And when we speak, we need to provide certainty to the person who we're speaking to. Otherwise, they're not able to trust us and they're not able to respect us and they're not able to follow us if we are a leader. And most of us speak in a very organic way and we don't think too much about what we're saying. And we use a lot of phrases and words that diminish our credibility. So I'm going to offer you three things that most of us do that diminish the certainty that we can provide in our speech. So the first thing is, is that we use a lot of hedge words or hedge phrases. Hedge words are things like probably or maybe, and a lot of us will add them to the end of sentences to kind of mitigate what we're saying, or maybe to not appear too arrogant, or to just cover our bases just in case we're wrong. But the thing is, is that hedge words make us sound confused and uncertain. So you can actually Google a list of hedge words and hedge phrases to double check if you're using these a lot. The second thing that we're doing that diminishes our communication is we're saying things like like or um, we're using filler words or even filler sounds. So this is something that I do and I know I'm guilty of it and I'm working on it and I am really trying not to use a filler word right now, but it's hard. It's really hard to not use filler words, but again, it makes us sound uncertain and confused and sometimes maybe a little bit juvenile. And so what we need to do instead of using filler words is we need to use pauses. So it's okay to pause when you're speaking. And sometimes it's even helpful because it allows the other person to process what you're actually saying. We can't just process communication as quickly as we speak sometimes. And so you're giving them a moment of silence to kind of understand what you've been saying. So the last thing that we do in communication that diminishes our credibility is we end our sentences with a question mark when we should be ending them with a period. For instance, when I say you are watching this TikTok video versus you are watching this TikTok video, it sounds a lot more uncertain when I end it with a question. A lot of us are ending sentences with questions that should not be ended with questions. So um, again, it's important to practice the tonality of your sentences in order to sound credible and certain and confident. Because if you don't sound credible, certain and confident, then other people won't perceive you that way.